G'day guys, Danny Kraken here, and welcome back for another episode of Barn Finders. So this one's going pretty well, um, I'm really enjoying it so far, hope you guys are too. It does seem like you are, uh, by the likes and things like that, so um, really happy about that. It's a great game, great looking game, bit of fun, bit of comedy in it. So uh, yeah, so I think where we're at at the moment, I'm just trying to remember, it's been a little while since I played it. Um, we've got all this gear in here ready to go. It is sometime in the morning. I'm not actually sure if you can check here the time. Oops. Uh, I don't think so. But I'm going to open the store. Make a little bit of money. Oops. Open those doors. Doesn't matter. They just sort of appear in here anyway. Now, I've got to keep an eye out for thieves. Because the last time I did this, there was a thief in here and he stole the bull bar that I had over there. So, I want to make sure that that doesn't happen again. Because that was really frustrating. Um, and now what I've found, here we go, right, this guy, I th oh no, he's, he's, ah, Bobby Gray. How you going, Bobs? Uh, let's haggle. Yeah, give me that extra, and we'll haggle one more time. Ooh, just got it in, beautiful. Okay, you can have it for $435. Up from 300 How you going, Turbo Calf? Yeah, we'll haggle, boy. Cool, got it in the green. That's all that matters. You really want it? Good. Then you can haggle again. Sweet. I love that second one. He's so happy to pay $78 more yeah. than the sell price. Go for it, boy. That's all yours. You got a toilet. Brand new toilet for your house. Get out of here, scamp. So, what does happen, I've noticed, sometimes is in the top left-hand corner, um, it'll actually... Can I put anything back down here? No. Um, it'll come up with a someone's face, their icon. Wait, wait. That's the thief. Oh, I just beat his ass. <laughs> wait, I kicked him in the nuts. That's all. That's perfect. Hey, what's going on, Jack? Let's haggle. Oh shit. I ain't paying no more. Let's haggle. You can pay more. Come on, dude. All right. Mmm. We can haggle. Yes. All you got to do is hit that green. If you hit that green in the haggle, you are good. Five hundred six bucks for a painting worth three seventy five. You are more than welcome. Dragon lady, how you going? Uh huh. How's life? Is my breath stink? What was that? Oh shit. Okay. We're good. A bit much, but you'll take it. Oh, we can haggle again. That's three hags. Three hags. Three haggles. That's hell good. I've never been able to do that before. Cool, man. That's a cool... That's a great price for uh, for that helmet. I've still got something... Can I... What is going on here? I've got nothing in there. Uh, oh, yes! I forgot. I forgot about uh, Shirley Love. Because I cleaned her up. Awesome. Let's see who buys that. I reckon it's going to be Turbo Calf. I reckon that the guy with the, the dodgy mustache. Hey, what's going on, Auction? Is your name literally Auction? Uh, we're going to haggle. Yeah, nailed it. Nailed it. Okay, we're going to haggle again. Oh, yeah. All right, you can have that for 145 That microwave is yours, pal. Enjoy. Enjoy that. Okay, so I've got nothing. Oh, someone else here. Hey, how you going? Is it Kabir? I haven't met you before. Yep, there we go. You can indeed. And we can haggle once more. And because you're happy, it slows down. Fantastic. So we're making bucks today, that's great. So yeah, as I was saying, sometimes in the top left hand corner there, you would you may have just seen it then. The face appears and then it's got a little uh, car icon saying that they're travelling to your store. Um, so... But sometimes it doesn't. Sometimes they just appear here. So I'm not really sure what that's about. Uh, right. No, turn that off. Um, okay, so I think... Whoa. Agent, agent? Hmm. Do I think, see anything suspicious? Yeah, there was a thief here, but I kicked hmm. him square in his eggs. Do you have some special items? What about this? This is very special. Hmm. She's a... Uh, oh, get out of here, mate. If you're not going to buy anything. Uh, get it, get it, get it. How you going, pal? Yep. <laughs> Hit that dark green. He's <laughs> so happy. I love getting ripped off by rednecks. We call this the red... Huh? But I nailed it. Whatever, dude. Get out of here. Do you want this or not, sir? Yes. Right here. Special item. Her name is Shirley Love. Uh, she's a 2000s model. 
uh, light mileage, restored, I'll have you know. Um, we have three points of entry. Oh, rude. Hey, she's back. Dragon lady. Oh, you want the uh, the black saviour coffee machine? Can't blame you. Nothing like a nice hot cup of joe. Okay, I can't haggle anymore, so yeah, you can, you can have it. Get out of here. Man, we are making bucks today. This is going well. Um, I'm not sure how long we can actually stay open for. I've never, I've never tested how long you can actually stay open for. Still got a fair few items. We've got the... <laughs> oh, I love it. Which one's this one? The sunny cat, that's right. And then we've got old mate over here, Mr. Fox. A couple of tyres still, car radio. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Keys jaw? You want know? Shirley Love? Oh, hey, um, there's no, no judgment here. Oh, damn ah! it. No judgment here at all. So for Shirley Love, I can give that her to you for the sweet price of twenty-two dollars. <laughs> oh, she's so happy. She's so happy. I love it. Um, feel, feel, How you um, going, Turbo Calf? I thought it was you that would have wanted to buy that. Buy Shirley Love. You look like a lonely man. <laughs> Yes, he's so happy. Okay. Bang. <laughs> Pay a little bit more. Whoa, okay. 68 bucks, man. You can take him. That's lucky because I wanted him. Wait, what What the hell were you buying? You weren't buying, Sunny Cat. No one wants the taxi dummies. You know, it doesn't bother me because I really want them. I want them. I want to keep them. I want a whole shop full of taxidermy. Um, okay, so I think we're going to call... Oh, God damn it. Hang on. Oh, you're here for Sunny Cat, yum, aren't you? Yum, yum, aren't you yum. Bubba? Yeah, you're a bubba who doesn't suit the name. <laughs> More like a Simon or something. Oh, there you go. Yeah. You can have it for 50 bucks. I didn't want to sell it to you, but you know what? You can have it. Right, I'm shutting the store. The hell out of here. Okay, otherwise we're just going to be doing this all day. Shop simulator. Uh, right, so what have we got here? Read your PC computer email. So let's have a look at that. Email. Old Bear Jackson. 380 bucks. Yo. Remember that guru, Lady Mary? After her disappearance, her house was empty for years. Now Miko owns it. If you win that special event, would you sell me that old clock? If you find it, of course. Thanks. By the way, buy yourself a lock picker. Just saying. Wink. Bear out. Cool. Sounds good to me. So, we want to go travel to Auntie Mary's house and we've got to buy it. Mails. Oh, what's this? Tired of video games about violence, guns and sex? Get in now on the latest Banff to award winning hit series Garage Sale Gurus. Dup. Oh, <laughs> I thought it was Gurus.play. What an idiot. It's a full stop. Plays the city slicker who goes out around town buying old junk at a deep discount and then flips everything for fat stacks selling it online. Do you have what it takes to be a Garage Sale gazillionaire? God damn. Can I actually do anything with this? I don't think so. I think it's just, it's just meant to be. Um, what do you call it? Cool. So I've got this one. So we need to go to Old Mary, uh, Auntie Mary's. Here we go. So Roosevelt Street is famous for being the only street in America where you could walk and drink while naked. <laughs> but after Mary's episode, this practice is no more. Oh no, Auntie Mary. That's so sad. Okay, let's get that and let's get let's get going. Let's get going, son. Come on, Uncle Billy. Pardon the truck, Uncle Billy. We're going. All right. So this is a. It's going to be an auction, it sounds like, but for an actual house. Yeah, so this is this is different. This is cool. We've got plenty of money. We've got like two and a half grand, I think. So we've got more than enough to win this. So we need to win it. And we're going to win it. I'll go as high as I need to to win this. Yeah, look at this. Sweet. There's a lot of stuff around here too that I can collect. So I'm going to go on a bit of a run around and grab all that stuff first. Just to make sure we've got more than enough coin. Um, I'll cut that out. And uh, and yeah, so we'll, we'll come back. Uh, we'll come back when... Yeah, look, there's loads of stuff I can break up, all this stuff. So I'm going to quickly run around the street, grab all of that stuff, and then we'll be back when it's, uh, when it's auction time. Okay, so I've run around, grabbed everything um, that I could find. There was a fair bit of stuff, not quite as much as I thought. There's hardly anything in the bins. Um, there was a floor panelling in here um, that, that spins around in the, the gold circle and makes a noise. That was in here. Um, apart from that, it was just like garbage, 
you know, bottles, um, a few things to smash up to get for uh, for materials and whatnot. Now, I've already got a level two lockpick. Um, being that this is the first lockpick in the game, I'd say you probably literally only need level one. So we should be fine. The next one is $690 to get to level three, which I think is max. Um, and I don't really want to do that just yet. So I'd rather have the money. So we've got, yeah, nearly two and a half thousand. So let's get into this auction and win this bad boy. Hell yeah. Okay, so I got 400 right here, 450, I got 500 right here, come on, y'all don't want this now, y'all go home, it's too much money for y'all, come on baby, this is mine, this is mine, isn't there meant to be a timer, what is going on here, oh, mm, 700 right here, 900 right here. I got it. I got it. I got that cash. I got that cash money right here. Let, God damn. 1300. 15. Damn it, man. 17. Come on. Can you guys get the hell out of here? Time left. Here we go. Here we go. Come on. Come on. Come on. I ain't taking no more of this, this crap. 1700 bucks. Oh my God. 23. I'm almost out of money. Burning hell. Get out of here, Lady Dragon. That's ours. Man, that took almost all of my money. I'm so glad we had that little bit extra. So there we go. That just goes to show you do need to run around and grab uh, everything from the auction sites before you start. I can't believe it costs that much. But to be fair, it's $2,350 for an entire house. So whew, $121 left. God damn it, man. Right. Let's go exploring. Clear all this out first. Just, uh, whoops. Grab all this stuff. Grab that. No. Okay. Here we go. So this is our brand new house that we just bought from Miko. Miko Auctions. Uh, a lot of graffiti. A lot of just normal rubbish around around the place. Pick all this stuff up. The usual. We've got to clear everything out. What have we got in the fridge? Anything? Nope. Close that. Get rid of that. Okay, so our first thing here is a... Oh, okay, so it's like a uh, pet carrier. So we'll grab that. Anything in there? Nope. Anything up here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, yeah, we got something here. Family tradition. I didn't read it. Take that. Shabby curtains. Anything behind here? No, so I think that's pretty pretty much everything in here. Next room. What have we got? Break all this up. Oh, I can hear something. I can hear it. It's in here. Oh, okay. Here we go. Lock picking. So what have we got to do? So move it. Wait. So how do we... Oh, I see. Right. So it's it's just... It's just an order thing. It's not, You don't actually really control it. You just move around until you get the right thing. It's a bit, it's a bit weird, but... I think, uh, right, let's get this on so we can see what we're bloody doing. It uh, takes a second to get your head around what's actually required in that one. Okay, nothing in that one. Nothing in there, nothing in there. Anything in these ones? Nope. Okay. Oh. Oh. Look at this. The Roadster. Yeah, we'll pick that up. Luckily, we had enough money for that. That's going to cost us 150 bucks just to get collected. Oh, what's this? The red cyclone. Very nice. Okay, what else have we got here? Let's get that off. Anything up there? Nope, nope, nope. So there's still something singing at me over there, which is fine. We will get to that. What's this? Galibo trumpet? Yeah. We play the trumpet now, fellas. We're coming up in the world. Okay, I'm gonna close this so I can walk past. Another poster. So what's this? The Roads to Cult gaining new followers. Man, San Harry. What even is this? What actually is this? The San Harry collection embraces rustic country charm with a combination of solid palm wood and green antique style. Sweet. We'll take it. Of course we'll take it. We'll take everything. Okay, there we go. So that's another wall skin. Oh, is that the pinky one? That might be similar to the uh, thing that I've got the 
flooring. Anything up here? Because they like to sometimes hide stuff on like shelves up here so you can't really see it. Yes, like an old gramophone. Topsky taste. Hell yes. I'd be a terrible antiques dealer because I just want to keep everything. Like if I was finding stuff like that, I just want to keep it like in my office or whatever. Okay, so we've, we've already sorted that one. I don't think we can do anything else in here. I think that's everything in here. So that was a really good room. That's awesome, that thing. Okay, so what else have we got? One hit of an axe on a bunk bed. And that's how you listen to Mike here. That's how you dismantle stuff. Okay, so that's going to be the backyard. So we'll go out there in a sec. We'll finish off in the house first. Uh, Alright, so I've been in there, been in there. Let's get rid of that. You usually hide stuff behind things like that as well. You can check all the walls because they put posters up and that kind of thing. Uh, what have we got? Yep, we got this thing here, which is living among pigs. Take that with us. There we go. What's this here? <laughs> is that Joe Exotic? That looks like Joe Exotic. I'm definitely putting that up in the uh, in the shop. Okay, grab all that. Uh, right, I think that's everything in here. Looks like it. Let's head upstairs. Uh, right, what have we got up here? Ooh, an alien. But they're not green, they're grey in this game. Grab all this, grab all this. <laughs> that's cool, like old hippie chick. In her, uh... What do they call that? Tie-dye. Uh, uh... Yeah! All the developers. Cool, grab all that, that's good. Uh, so we've got a door there, we'll get there in a sec. We'll just grab all this stuff. Oh, that's cool. Raven leader. That's really cool, I like that. Okay, got that. You can hear something holy grailing in there. So, we'll get in there in a sec. I just want to make sure I've got everything in here. Because we need the money. Desperately, because we spent all of our money on the auction here. Okay, here we go. I love the, the ominous music, eh? Alright, so it's that one. This one. And then that one. Got it. So, Liz, it is just the order. That's all you got to do. You just got to move around till you find the order. Here we go. I can still... I think that must be on the roof. Perhaps. Mary, who is a charismatic cult leader. Ah, I see. So she, that's Mary, and she was the one who owned this house, but I think she she must have died. And, oh, yes. Yes. Oh, we're, we're set now, boys. And the mouse to go with it? Lemon Ark. We are lucky today. Oh, this whole thing I can take. Zonda January. Nice. Smash these out. Nope. Uh, right, what else have we got in here? So we're checking everything. So they, no, get closed. Uh, nothing there. There is something right there, though. Big patch of it. In here. Whoops. Nope. I think we can smash this up. We can, and we get... <laughs> okay. So out of a full timber frame bread, bed, we get uh, bread. We get uh, a nice bit of rope. What's this here? Luna the dog. I can't really see it. That's cute puppy. Cute puppy. Anything on the back? Nope. We'll take it. So this hasn't been too bad. I mean, it'll be interesting to see how much money we made out of this because it cost us like $2,350. $2,350 to, uh, to win this. So, wait, can we smash this? Can we do something with it? I was thinking maybe there's like a secret entrance behind here. But no, so there must be another way to get to where we need to get to. Maybe out the back. Because I think that's everything now in here, isn't it? That's the house done. I don't have a key. Can't I just lock it? Pick like lock pick it? Lock it. I thought I found everything in here though. Oh, unless there's a shed. There might be a shed. Let's go around the back. If we can. Can we get in here? Oh, how do I get out? Man! Okay, so we've got to find the key. It doesn't look like I can get out. Yeah, they, he, he... Do you remember in the first episode, the alien came down and said he'd randomly put more stuff down? I think that's what's happening, because I'm sure that I grabbed all of that stuff when we first came in. 
So like it's it just sort of keeps you going, keeps the money coming in. So there must be a key around somewhere that I've missed. Okay, so she probably she would probably keep her key like in a room, wouldn't she? Don't you think? That would probably make sense. Can I just smash the window out, climb out? Can I do anything with this? This sort of seems oddly placed. Okay, so this is a bedroom. So you would think if there was going to be a key, it could be in here. Nothing in there. Uh, there's nothing, definitely nothing in here, was there? No. Strange. And I can hear what I think is the golden toilet paper, which is probably going to be on the roof. So can I climb over the front, maybe? I don't know why I'd bother about a locked door, though. I'd just kick it in. Or kick it out, you know what I mean? I wouldn't be mucking around with a bloody locked door. Look at the state of the house. Okay, so I can't get around there. Uh, oh, it's got a basketball hoop. Sweet. Okay. So I think that's the... That's the locked... Or that's the room that we... Doesn't seem to be any access to. Is there a way I can smash out wood on these upstairs rooms? You know, like this. No. That's pretty annoying. So, because the the room is on the other side of this. But I'm going to imagine that you can't get up there. Unless... Uh, you can't get in there unless you can get on the roof and then you smash in the the wood and take that curtain off the, the rails. Um, so what I need to do is find this bloody key. So I'm going to have a look around and I'll come back once I've found it so we're not wasting any more time. Okay, we're back. Um, I'm just blind as a bat. So they're, they're hanging on the wall right behind the dog dog picture that we took down, the, the photo of a dog or the portrait of a dog. So they're right here. So we'll grab the bloody keys. Full. I wonder how many of you guys spotted that. Let me know in the comments if you spotted that when I took the thing off and you were screaming at me saying they're where they were. Right, so we're out here now. So let's quickly smash through all this. Oh, yes. Now we're talking. A nine mil. Definitely taking that. Take the welcome mat. Suspiciously clean, new looking welcome mat. Horse poster. So much stuff. Cool. So, what have we got around here? We'll just quickly clear all this up. Grab all this stuff. And then we'll go around the side to... Oh. oh. Okay, so we can climb up that way. Right. And then, is there something on the other side? We'll find out. We'll clear all this up first. Don't want to miss anything. Chop up all the firewood into small wooden thatches with, uh, with nails in them. Cool. Anything on the... Yes. Where did she go? Mysterious disappearance of cult leader. Okay, so she didn't actually die. We don't know where she is. God, are we going to find her up here? That would be so messed up. Ah, that would be too... Mate. Yeah, okay. So we'll jump off that side and get up the, uh, the ladder. Anything over here? Doesn't look like it. Can we light a fire? Baby, come and light my fire. Is there anything to dig? I thought maybe there'd be a digging spot over here, but maybe not. Okay, I just want to quickly check over here before we go up there. Make sure we're not missing anything. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes, there is digging. Cool. So we'll quickly dig this out. The final fish. Sweet. So a cheap but beautiful adult cremation urn. It has a simple and classic... Hmm. Is this where she is? Are you in here, Auntie Mary? Is it Auntie Mary? I've forgotten what this... Yeah, Auntie Mary, yeah. Are you in here? Alright, we'll take it. 
anything else to dig around. Yes, there is. Dig, 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 dig. Oh, the Scarlet Boar. It's like the jewel of the ocean. But maybe the jewel of the volcano. Stupid. So we'll take that. Anything else to dig? Uh, oh, what's this? Hot foot. That's like a hot water heater. Cool. Uh, so we'll just check around here. Is there anything else to dig at all? Doesn't look like it. Whoops. Unless there's something around here. Need this. Grab that. So I think we're probably pretty good around here. I reckons. I reckon so. So we'll quickly nip around now to the... Gotta climb up. Is that stuff? It is. I wanted to shoot it. My antique cans. Okay. So let's get up here. Oh. oh god, that's that's difficult. Do I have to get do I have to put something on that? How the hell am I supposed to do that? How far, how close can I get to this without falling off? Yeah, okay, this is going to be a little tricky. Hmm. So it looks like I can reach it from there. Yes, okay, got it. Cool. Sweet, what's in here? Smash all this up. Grab that, grab that. Smash the chair. Such a good axe. Okay, just checking up here. Make sure we got everything. Housewife mannequin. There you go. For all you lonely sods out there. Dress her up. You missed out on Shirley Love, but uh, have we got a surprise in store for you. Doesn't cook. Doesn't clean. Doesn't do what you tell her to do. So all you 1950s boys out there. But maybe... She won't talk back, so I don't know. Okay, here it is. Insomnium Bang. That's the mission thing, so we'll grab that. And that's everything, we got everything. Now. <laughs> now, the only thing is... I haven't seen the golden toilet paper anywhere. But I'm sure I could hear it in the house when I was in there so I'm not quite sure what the go is with this so I am not too sure how you're supposed to get it I'm going to quickly muck around on it because I don't want to let it go because then I've got to pay to come back here to, to have a look so I'm going to muck around with that I'll be back in, in as soon as I figure it out I'll be back okay worked it out so again in her bedroom so you know how I was saying I thought this was like a secret compartment, like there was a door or something behind it? Right, so what it is, this here, this cable, trace it all the way back to the switch. We click that switch. And ta da Secret room. So we can get in here. And look. It's toilet paper head. And then we smash the granite statue, and it makes wood for us. Yeah. How cool is this room, though? Secret little hideout. See, now I would have thought that you possibly could have found her in here. You know what I mean? Like, um, this is sort of where she was. I wonder why that music continually plays. Is that just in this room, or is there something else in here? I don't think there is. I can't interact with anything. Oh, now the music stopped. Okay, cool. Well, that's it for uh, for this this house. So let's get back to the uh, let's get back to. Oh, I better shut my door so no one breaks in. Seeing as I own it, what are you doing, Billy? Billy, get down here. How did you even get up there? Did you guys see what happened? How did he get up there? Hmm. 
No one knows? Okay. I'm going to rip all of you off when you come to my store next. Come on, Uncle Billy. Get down from there, mate. we got to go. Loading up the roadster. Wow, that's uh, <laughs> it's an interesting way of doing it. And we got everything. Sweet. Nothing better than leaving these places when you've got everything done. So good. Okay, so as always, we'll get this one unloaded. Billy will do all the heavy lifting for us. Uncle Billy. Uncle Billy! And then, now, what have we got? Let's get everything that we've got first in here. So we'll go click. Click on there, click on there. Nothing on that one. More stuff on there. Oh, we've got no more big stuff. What? That was weird. It quacked at me and then said that I did have stuff. So we've still got two things. We've got one dirty thing, so we'll grab that out and clean that now. So that we can get that up on the shelf. So what have we got that's dirty? Dirty, dirty. That, right here. Oh god. Where did that just go? Did that go back? Please tell me that went back in here. Ooh, okay. I forget that you're automatically holding it when it comes out. Okay, so let's get that in there. There we go. There we go. Clear all that dirt off and the muck and whatever else has been going on. Awesome. There we go. So that's done. Put that one away. Uh, and I think that's everything that we've... What the hell? They're chasing me. Now, one thing I really do want to do is get the uh, repair station up and running. What have we got in storage? Because I may as well get... Some other... Oh, I can't. I haven't got the money. Actually, let's let's quickly do this. Yeah, see how that, that photo's changed? It's now Mothman. So we'll, we'll complete this job to old Bear Jackson. That'll give us 380 buckaroos. So we've got 561. So I just want to see what items we've got in storage as to what things we need. So we need to... Unsellable. Oh, I know what these are for. Right. Let me quickly show you what they are, are for. These are the things we need to repair, right? So we need the repair station to do that. Um, so we've got that, we've got that, and we've got that. All big things. Okay. So I do need to get more. I really need to get these things done. But let me show you what those unsellable things are for. I didn't even realize. So you go into the computer. Uh, you go to item catalog. Next page. And then with all of these where there's exclamation marks, you go into them. And if it's got an exclamation mark here, you click. See? So for each 40 catalog updates, you get one free car skin. So these are the things that you're, that they're not sellable. You can't sell them, but you're picking them up while you're out and about in the world. So you just go through, it doesn't cost you anything as far as I'm aware. Um, but you just, you actually get money for it. So I think, so is that, wait, is that costing us money? Let's just see. So we're at 581. No, we're at 591. Cool. So we're actually making money. So it gives us five dollars per thing. Um, so you just go through and you click all of these, and then once you uh, have completed them, I think you get a reward. But as it says down here, you get a free car skin uh, for every 40 that you do, which is cool. So I'm going to next page, run through and do these. The scrolling is a little weird, so it's actually easier to sort of grab the scroll bar and just roll down like this because it sort of it bugs out a little bit and it, it just stops working um, we may actually get I wonder if we've got another seven probably not we'll be pretty close oh well, maybe two more yeah awesome new car skin sweet so I have to look at what that is lemon arc lemon white lemon buck uh, so we've pretty much got the whole Almost a whole computer. We just need a lemon magic now. Oh, processor. Limel Xeon. 3.33 gigahertz, 8 core. Graphics Mammoth HD 44750. RAM 16 gig. 2 terabyte Satan. Holy crap, man. <laughs> the monitor lets you enjoy an immersive viewing experience and DMA dog sync instantly refreshes and refines images. Ergonomically designed optical optical tracking technology working on many different surfaces and ideal usage for home office and game. Fantastic. Nico console. Um, cool. 
the road stuff. Okay, so that's everything. Cool, so that's that. We got a little bit extra money for that. That was bloody good. Um, so what I do want to do then in that case is I want to upgrade these. Uh, how much money have we got? 716. So let's go that one. We'll put that on there. And then this one as well I want to do. Uh, yep. All right. So that gives us all those shelves, all the, for the bigger items. Um, and I've still got one thing in storage, which will be that thing we cleaned, I think, which will go onto one of these, uh, unless it fits on here. Oops. Uh, no, no, no. Okay, so that's awful. So that's fine. So once we sell one of these, we'll replace it with the, uh, the thing. Have I got enough money for that? No, I don't. Um, cool. So that's everything in here. I did say I wanted to quickly put up one of them posters, so I'll show you how we do that. Uh, actually, I'm going to do that in my room, just to show you how we do it. So, yeah, the next one, oh yeah, we, we got that to sell as well. We'll make a heap of money off that. How much is that going for? 1345, that's more than the Jeep, that's good. So this is the repair station that I want to build, which is 800. So the next 800, once we sell all this stuff, um, I wouldn't mind getting that repair station because then all that stuff we've got that's broken, uh, the four broken things. We also need the assembly station because we have 11 things that we can start assembling. Um, the only thing we have to be careful of is if we ne if we have another auction that we have to do. That's the only thing that worries me because of how expensive that last auction was. Um, but that's alright, we'll make the money back. Okay, so in here you can upgrade like that one there or this one here. So I might change this one. So where was it? Yeah, Joe Exotic. Hell yeah. It looks like we've only got one more golden paper to get. Unless the top shelf, yeah, the top shelf probably does it as well, I would say. Because otherwise it's going to be a bloody short game. But uh, yeah, so with that, I'm going to leave this one here. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks for coming out. Um, I'm still loving this game. Can't wait to play more of it. Um, loving the characters, loving the, the game uh, mechanics as well. It's actually quite fun. Uh, breaking things down, searching for stuff, working the little puzzles out to, to get into different rooms and whatnot. Um, it does take some time to do that sort of stuff. Um, but yeah, once you figure it out, there's a bit of a bit of a sense of uh, satisfaction there that you've been able to do it. So um, as always, thanks heaps for coming out. Really appreciate it. Hit that like button if you're enjoying the, uh, in the series. Let's me know that you are and let's me know that uh, this is the kind of content you want to see. Um, comment down below if there's anything you want to see different, if you want me to try anything. Um, if you just want a general chit chat, just chuck it in the comments for me. If you're new, please subscribe. Um, daily content coming out every day. But uh, yeah, as always, till next time, have a good one. Catch ya.